Diksha Chatterjee joining us live on the broadcast show. You've been tracking all the details and developments of this big story from uh, ISRO. Confirmation finally coming in. Uh, what a day it has been. What a morning it has been. Chandrayaan 2 successfully entering the orbit of the moon. Well, absolutely. So, a historical moment for the country as Chandrayaan 2 successfully enters the lunar orbit of the moon. Now, as we've been telling our viewers, this is a very uh, significant day because remember, we have done a soft uh, uh, landing in the moon and uh, that particular rover, which definitely means that uh, it uh, has abided in fall as far as uh, uh, what was expected by the scientists. Remember, as we were telling, that the speed needed to be perfect in order to actually uh, make sure that that it enters the lunar orbit of the moon and with that a very successful uh, story that uh, probably we've achieved and uh, while we talk about it you know uh, the uh, uh, when the chandrayaan 2 was launched in july uh, 22nd uh, we saw those ecstatic uh, people there at isro who were extremely happy uh, for actually successfully uh, launching uh, this uh, project because there was a technical glitch which they toiled and worked in a week to make this day happen and as we talk right now chandrayaan 2 india's mission to the moon has entered the lunar orbit of the moon. 11 a.m. is that presser that right now we're waiting for to probably get us a better understanding uh, to give us a better demonstration of what happens from now. All right. It has been a historic feat as far as Chandrayaan 2 is concerned. The countdown to the epic landing literally one can say at this juncture has begun. Chandrayaan 2 on schedule as per uh, you know what isro had said 9:30 am indian standard time was when it would enter the orbit of the moon and it has uh, so sure this is of course uh, you know it's it's uh, uh, it's a step uh, that in essentially goes to show that everything is on track and as per schedule Well, absolutely. And uh, it is as per schedule, August 20th, they said that the uh, spacecraft will actually uh, fire itself into the lunar orbit that has successfully been uh, injected. Now, September 7th is the day when we expect that soft landing. Just for the benefit of our viewers, I will just read out a few pointers what exactly uh, happens from now. So, there will be a four-orbit maneuver to enable the spacecraft to enter in the final orbit, passing the lunar poles at a distance of about 100 kilometers from the moon's surface. So, right now, it's in 100 kilometers kilometers away from the moon's surface, if I can just explain it in a layman uh, term. Subsequently, uh, the Vikram lander will then separate it from the orbiter on September 2nd. And then finally, the soft landing will happen on September 7th. So that is right now the wait uh, that has begun 100 kilometers away from the surface of the moon is where our orbi uh, the orbit has been successfully, the spacecraft has been successfully injected into the lunar orbit. And uh, uh, right now, just probably a few days, and September 7th is that day when we will see that success story be completed with a soft landing target being achieved. All right. Uh, so, Shreya, you know, confirmation, of course, coming in from ISRO at the moment that the insertion into the lunar orbit, uh, you know, is as per schedule. And it is, uh, you know, like we're flashing on our screens at the moment, an 18-day countdown now to the September 7th uh, landing, which is now we will essentially see that the rover, which is Vikram, will um, uh, will detach itself and, uh, you know, uh, go towards uh, the South Pole uh, for that soft landing. You know, India at this juncture, uh, Shreya, let's make no mistake, has crossed a major milestone. It is history and nothing short of that that's been scripted this morning. Well, absolutely. It is definitely history that uh, has uh, uh, probably been achieved. We're just closer to making that final step, uh, remember, because we've been talking about how tricky this whole mission actually be uh, because of the fact that we are doing a soft landing in the moon. And as you've been also telling, uh, Rishika, you know, it's just about the fact that uh, we are in... All right, uh, we seem to have lost that line with my colleague Shreya, but we'll of course be closely monitoring this story. What a morning it has been, uh, Chandrayaan 2 entering uh, the lunar orbit as per schedule and it is 18 days to that countdown when it finally makes that soft landing. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.